Welcome back everyone. In this question, we're told that a town has a population of 10,800 in 2004. Then 10 years later, its population grew to 18,800. And we have to determine the annual growth rate. So showing this on a timeline first, let's say this here is 2004. It has, this town has a population of 10,800. 10 years later, so that's in 2014, population will be 18,800. And we have to figure out what is that annual growth rate every year, right? Now, instead of using this um, notation of years, I'm gonna introduce another variable, let's say t, and t is going to represent the number of years after 2004. So at 2004, that is a t value of 0. And then 2014, that's going to have a t value of 10. Right? 10 years after 2004, which is 2014. So what we have to do here is take our general expression that we know of, or we have a final amount is equal to initial amount, 1 plus r to the power of t. And we are solving for the annual growth rate, so we're going to be solving for this r value here. So that means we have to plug something in for this final amount, the initial amount, and then this t amount. Well, the initial amount we know is 10,800. That's what the population is starting at, and we said that a t-value of 0 represents 2004. Now this 1 plus r, this r we're going to be solving for, and we're told in 10 years the final population is 18,800. Right, so now notice that we have an equation here with one unknown this R here that we could solve for. The way we do that is um, get rid of this initial value in front, so we have to divide it because it's attached to it. So these will cancel out here. 18,800 divided by 10,800, if you do that in your calculator, that will be approximately 1.74074. I would maybe round this number here to five decimal places. Don't round too much because then it might throw your final answer off. And this is going to equal 1 plus r to the power of 10. And now, how do we isolate for this r here? Well, we got to get rid of this exponent 10. The way we do that is we take both sides to the power of the reciprocal of that exponent. So notice this is 10 over 1. The reciprocal of that is 1 over 10. This is 1 over 10 as well. So notice that 10 times 1 over 10 is just 1. So 1 plus r to the power of 1 is just 1 plus r. So continuing this up here, we'd be left with 1 plus r on the right side. We actually don't even have to put these brackets here. And then on the left side, we'd have this whole expression. So... 1.74074 to the power of 1 over 10, or the 10th root of that number, right? If we're taking something to the power of 10 and we want to get rid of that exponent, we would take both sides to the root 10, the 10th root of both sides. Now, when you do this in your calculator, you would get 1.057. So now we isolate for the r, we bring the 1 over, 1 1.057 minus 1, that gives us 0 0.057. That's going to equal r. Multiply that by 100, so r is equal to 5.7%. And that is the answer. That is the annual growth rate of this population. So I'd recommend always taking these questions, drawing a timeline so you can see visually what's happening, and then using that general format that we know of, plug everything in, and then solve for whatever variable you are asked to solve for. In this case, we are solving for the R, got 5.7%.